Colossians says this in 1 verse 27. Christ in you, the hope of glory. To behold the Christ in another person is to see that person as he or she really is. To see them as a child of God. To see their beautiful spirit. To see their potential. To behold the Christ in others is to recognize the love, the intelligence, the positive power that is within them. And to know that the Christ is inherent in them. Guiding and inspiring them and bringing them their own highest good into manifestation. It is to free them to express themselves in their own individual way. Not my way, but their way. To let go of anxious or limiting or fearful thoughts about others, and to know that the Christ indwelling them is bringing them safely and successfully through the experiences in life. By beholding the Christ in others, we are opening the door of our consciousness so that our own Christ nature can flow through. As we express the loving spirit of Christ, we become ever more aware of our own divine potential. We behold the Christ in ourselves and we behold the Christ in others as we give thanks for the peace and the wisdom and love of the Christ finding expression in each and every one of us. I pray that you do today, starting with family and then to friends and then to strangers. God bless you.